everyone i hope you're well so for today's video i'm actually going to do a weekly vlog it's currently monday it's about probably like 11 i'm not too sure but yeah i'm absolutely starving so i'm gonna go make breakfast i'm gonna have pancakes which i think i've shown in a video before and i think i'm gonna have vanilla yogurt on top because i had it yesterday basically and it was actually amazing so eddie's barking downstairs lovely um so i'm gonna have that probably with oh, it's quite hot i was gonna say i'll have a cup of tea but it's kind of hot outside so we'll see how warm it is downstairs because my bedroom always gets really hot the sun like just shines in fucking sauna in here but before i go i've got my favorite dress on if you see my asos and top shop haul then you would have seen this dress and this is the first time I worn it because I was gonna I planned to wear it the other day but then it was really hot so I ended up wearing a different dress but I'm wearing it today and I absolutely love it. It's like, ugh, I need to cut these off because they're annoying me and they keep coming out. So I'll do that. But yeah, I actually love this dress so much. So I thought I'd change up my pancakes a little bit. I really not. I've just added blueberries <laughs> instead, so this is what they look like. Oh, I'm so excited to eat these. I'm just waiting for them to like a bit more so I can flip them over because at the moment they kind of just separate and become a big mess so that's not good but yeah I'm really excited I probably will still put the uh, yogurt on top because that literally just oh my god completes it so I currently flipped to a flip that one and that one that wasn't really ready yet but this one's looking nice and then this one I still need to flip but oh my god it looks I'm literally so excited to eat these in case you haven't seen my video where I made these basically it's just Half a cup of oats, um, a banana and a quarter of milk. So I used unsweetened almond milk or any milk of your choice. I would recommend plant-based milk. <laughs> and that's it. And then I just added some blueberries in. But you can have them with nothing else and just the free ingredients. And they are literally amazing. This is literally, these are just the ingredients that I use for porridge. But instead of milk, I use like half a cup of... No, just a bit more, like three quarters of a cup of water instead of a quarter of milk. Oh no! Oh, I almost I skimmed the pan. You can also blend it as well. I did that once, but I just, it was just too much fat. So I'm not doing that again. <laughs> and I feel like because I'm using oats, like it's just a whole different type of pancake, and I just love it. I'm blending it kind of just lost that. So. We're never doing that again. But. So this is the yogurt that I use. It's from Aldi, I think, and it's just the Life is So Yummy Vegan Vanilla Yogurt, and it's really, really nice. So it's now half twelve, and I've had my breakfast, and it was amazing. I'll show you a little clip of the final product. They were literally so, so good. Like the blueberries just made it. I don't think I needed the yogurt because blueberries just like made it amazing. So definitely recommend trying it out if you haven't already it is so good i really need to clean these i need to like bleach them or something because they're just not white anymore and i don't want to buy a new pair because one i can't afford to two like i know these can well i'm hoping these can just get really white again because they're just really stained like they're just why has it got blue on there like no so yeah i might do that tomorrow because i'm gonna wear them today but yeah, I thought I'd just do a little catch up because obviously I haven't really actually sat down and spoke about what's been going on. I finished university. Well, no, I haven't finished university. I finished second year university. Oh my God. <laughs> I finished. I finished second year university. So I've only got one more year to go. So that's really exciting. Uh, I can't wait to go back to university. Like it's not even because like, we're in lockdown. I think I actually do really enjoy university and I actually can't wait to just be studying so basically the modules that i'm doing are tv uh script writing <laughs> um oh i forgot oh work placement and then a boring one which is just you have to take it but we'll forget about that because i don't like it oh i actually um started putting some prints up on my wall so i'll include the time lapse that i did i did this on saturday <laughs>
not finished yet like I just put them up because I wanted something on my walls and basically I want the prints to be in frames but um obviously not like not many places are open at the moment I don't really want to order them online so I'm just gonna wait for now because there's no hurry in that but yeah I've, I've had these prints for so long I used to have some of them prints up in my room first year uni and then I actually thought they were in Stoke and then I just was like I picked this forward up and I was like they're in Manchester so I was really happy so I was like right I'm gonna put some up I've still got loads to put up but I just couldn't really I don't know I, was, I didn't know how to do it so I was like right I'll just leave it how it is for now I like them and the majority of them are from I think all but one are from an illustrator called Ella Ella Masters Ella Masters I think it is um I'll include her Instagram below because she's so good and then the other one which is the fox is from I bought it from in when I was in Edinburgh so literally years ago can't remember the artist's name but I'll link it below as well oh and then the prints of uh the, it's like it looks like a painting it might be um <laughs> I really should know that's from I bought that in Santorini I might read in the garden maybe I finished a book okay so I read um this username username Evie I've had this book for years i literally got it at his book signing oh yeah and i've got the little um i don't know what you would call that but it was just like at the day like saying the rules and stuff um so i read that in a day because i mean it's really easy it's just it's a graphic novel so like obviously there's not much um to read but it's, i actually really enjoyed it and i've got um the second one username generated so I might read that or I might start another book. But um, yeah, this is actually really cool. I just never got around to reading it. And I thought, you know what, I'm going to read it. And like, what, the graphics, would you call it? <laughs> Are so, so pretty and amazing. But like, so cool. Um, I'm going to show you some pages. Da, da, da. But yeah, um, so that was a cool book to read. If you have any good book recommendations please let me know because I have a few to read but I always like to keep an eye out for new ones. So it's now Tuesday and I'm just about to get in the shower because I just did a little workout but while I was doing my workout my ASOS delivery came and it's only two items and it's the same item I just got it in two sizes because I wasn't sure which size would fit me properly so I thought I'd just get both but yeah I'm really excited for this because the item I mean online look really really nice so yeah I'm gonna get a shower first and then I'll try it on because I'm not trying it on right now because I'm a little hot it was meant to come tomorrow so it's a day early so well done ASOS so I've just got out of the shower and got dressed so I thought I'd open the ASOS parcel because I'm really excited like I said it's just the same top in two different sizes so I've got in a size 10 and a size 12 we'll start with the 12 <laughs> we'll work our way down Ooh, okay Okay, so this is the top. It's like um it's just got one one sleeve, which I thought was really cool. So it's just like that, and it's got this gorgeous like peplum detailing, and the back is elasticated. But yeah, that is so cool, and the sleeves like quite like a balloon style sleeve. So that's that. I'll try this one on first, and then if it's a bit big, then we'll try the ten on. What? Yeah, I really like the colour it's and the material actually looks really nice. So I ordered it off ASOS, but it's from Miss Selfridge. So this is the top on, and I think it's well. Firstly, you can see my bra through it. I've just put like a strapless one on, but yeah, I think it's just too big. So I'm gonna try the ten on. So this is the ten on, which fits a lot better, but you can still see my bra. So I'm gonna take the bra off and see if that makes a difference. And like, yeah, if I could go braless, basically. But this is what it looks like so far so this is it without a bra on and oh, it's really hard to know if to keep it or not because i really like it but i feel like it could be a bit smaller here just a tiny little bit please let me know what you think um i'm gonna get my mum's opinion when she gets back from the shop i probably won't turn it just because without a bra on I just don't feel very secure and with this type of top there's no just doesn't really work so I'm just about to take the dogs for a walk at the park but look what happened this morning I um was like doing my skincare routine and this which comes in like a little bottle you would have seen it in my ASOS haul but um 
it's done it before where I pick it up and the lid isn't attached to the bottle so just the lid comes off so the bottle was stuck in this so I had to open the bottom and it all like leaked so yeah it's not good normally I keep all the stuff in the packaging but I'm gonna have to put this in the bin now and I lost product so I'm not impressed but uh yeah I'm gonna go to the park now I've actually got a double layer of lilac on today look at that wow I'm not sure how cold or warm it's going to be outside because in here it's warm but I feel like outside it's going to be colder so I've got a jumper on and it's the same colour. Wow fashion Easter. So it's now Wednesday it's actually quite late it's like 10 to 7 and I'm just about to have a muffin. I actually made these muffins so you would have seen in like two videos back that I baked blueberry muffins and this is one of them I picked the biggest one that was on the plate I did want to heat it up but our microwave just isn't working so I couldn't but it should be really nice anyway and yeah so today I've literally just I did a workout this morning had a shower wash my hair <laughs> late dry naturally so it was really wavy so I ended up just putting it in a bun because it's really warm outside so I went and sunbathed and I've been reading this book it's really really good but i've read me before you now i'm reading after you and then i've also got still me which i'm sure is the one after this one but yeah really really good book and just like so easy to read like normally i'm one of the, one of them people that like read a little bit and then get bored but i actually just ha like i just haven't wanted to put this book down today so i've just been in the garden sunbathing and yeah, I'm just going to chill out now and watch some YouTube and eat my muffin. Oh my god, okay. So it's now Thursday and it's about, what time is it? 10 to 12 and I've just done a workout. I finished the workout a while ago but then I ended up um, just sorting out some parcels and then Maisie does this thing that if she's licking, like she came in my room, she was like really scratching at my door. She came in, she was like licking the carpet. I was like, Maisie, you do not want to be licking this carpet, especially just after I've worked out on it. And then I was like, she needs, she wants to throw up because if she can't get to grass, then she'll lick instead. So I've just been down here waiting so I can shut the door so I can go for a shower. But she's done. She didn't actually throw up, I don't think, but um, TMI. Uh, but yeah, I'm about to go for a shower and I'm going to make breakfast. I think I'm going to have pancakes again because literally I do this thing well. I'll have porridge every day or pancakes every day. And like I said, our microwave keeps not working. So I'm not going to risk it and try and make porridge. I mean, I can make porridge in a pan. That's how I used to always make it. But our small pan broke. So we only have like massive ones and it just, it just won't work. Like they're too, too big. So pancakes is for breakfast. Okay, maybe I'm not going for a shower just yet because she wants to, to go back outside. What's she doing? Mm, okay, I guess I'll just stay down here for a bit longer. So I was just, um, what was I doing? Oh yeah, I'm just, so I'm currently making my pancakes and there's a knock at the door. And it was my neighbours, it was my next door neighbours and they brought over, I mean it is for my parents, but he was like, oh you can have some chocolates too. Obviously I can't, but this is so sweet. Some really fancy hotel chocolates and I don't even know what that is. Wine? Yeah, it's a type of really fancy wine. <laughs> I'm not fancy so I don't know. But yeah, basically there's this cat. Um, let me flip my pancakes and then I'll tell you. Okay. So basically it's this cat that um, my mum like sort of helped with my neighbours because basically it was this stray cat and it was getting into fights a lot with my next door neighbour so my mum rang RSPCA to see if like you know the cat could get rehomed and they took it to I don't know where they took it but my mum and my next door neighbours took the cat and um yeah and that's really sweet and apparently my dad I think my dad painted next door neighbours fence so it was like a thank you for them two things. And I just, like, it's so, 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 so cute. My mum's out the moment. He was like, is your mum? And I was like, no, just, just me. <laughs> that is literally adorable. So, I mean, I also don't have a bra on, so I told like this really cute story while I'm not wearing a bra. But I'm about to go in the garden and sunbathe. I don't want to wear a bra while I'm sunbathing, so. I mean, apparently, just between you and me, their cat. Is bullying my cat. <laughs> we'll keep that on the low. My cat as well, like Miley. Miley's my cat. And Miley's quite like um, 
a nervous shy cat and apparently she don't really like going outside and my mum was found out that their cat is bullying my cat so I just need to make I need to make Miley a bit more stronger sure, but literally the amount of cat drama we have on this walk in my house in particular another thing that happened recently cat drama wise was that my cat my other cat Tilly was actually attacked by a dog mm, it's Thursday so we're like Oh, uh, last Friday she was attacked. I'm not going to go into it because I actually filmed like a real long clip me going into detail about it but then I was like I really don't want to include this so I ain't but um, yeah she's doing so much better though. Um, she's back outside so now I'm like really on edge anytime I hear the dogs bark or like today oh was it yes I think it was yeah it might have been today or yesterday I think it was this morning I heard someone like shout for the dog and I, I thought like oh it's, it's my next it's like opposite she's shouting for her dog and it's just like a really small dog but even then i was like oh i need to make sure i like like jumped up and locked out the window and i was like all right see me dogs where's tilly but yeah i am gonna go and finish these pancakes got my strawberries up and just in case you wanted to see this is my final product Mwah. So it's now Saturday and I did film some clips yesterday but I'm not including them just because I was having one of them days where you just really hate the way you look and it mostly was down to my sunburn which is going down now but it was really bad yesterday and I just looked a mess and everything that I filmed I was just like I was just like not getting annoyed but I was just like oh my god like no I can't include that so yeah it's now Saturday I think I'm going to film a video today, the plan was to film a video today, but again, I'm just not feeling like 100%, I think it literally is just down to my sunburn, um, because it's like on my chest, on my face, I mean it's everywhere, but my arms are okay actually, <laughs> my arms aren't sunburn, um, my legs were, but they, it's gone now, um, so that's good, my stomach is so sunburned and it's so painful, so I did a workout, this morning and yesterday morning oh my god it's so painful especially because the workouts i'm doing are like ab workouts so it's a lot of like crunches and stuff like that yes really hurts i power through i'm not doing much really uh, i just had breakfast i had some porridge oh, i miss porridge and it was it was so good it was just oats water and strawberry jam amazing so i kind of let my hair dry naturally because i just couldn't i actually couldn't be asked to get the hair dry and dry it i actually kind of like it wavy even though i sort of do always think i look like hagrid when i have it wavy and then i've got this pretty dress on which i absolutely love so much what did i do yesterday yesterday i i really didn't do that much i went to sainsbury's actually and that was the first time i went to a shop in ages like literally i think the last time i went to a shop was easter sunday yeah, Easter Sunday so like I haven't been in a shop since then so it was um I mean it was nice to just get out but yeah it was an experience just because I haven't been in a shop in so long I finished my book but I'm gonna uh not talk about it because I want to talk about it in the video that I want to film today so it's a bit later on now and I was actually just gonna film a segment where I was gonna cut this top up because basically my mum was like um your top has a hole in what the heck <laughs> I was like, um, okay. So what I was gonna do was cut it like just above and have it more like cropped. But I was like, oh, I'll just try it on before I do it. Cause you know, just in case. And I've changed my mind. All I'm gonna do is just tuck it in <laughs> because I think I'd rather have a top that I can tuck in instead of a cropped top. So that's what I'm gonna do. So uh, that was a very short segment of literally nothing because what I wanted to, well what I was going to do is out the window it's sort of good because my fabric scissors are at uni so I only have well these ones which I don't think would have been sharp enough so it's now eight o'clock and I'm feeling like having a little pamper night and by pamper night I mean putting a face mask on because my skin is so bad like I come out with loads of little spots on my chin my forehead is really dry today I thought oh I might put a little bit of foundation on try and cover my sunburn no I moisturised my face, did my skincare routine and then put the foundation on and I got a brush and I was like, this isn't working. Got a beauty blender. No, it was just like, my, my skin's so dry. So, I've got this uh, 
face mask because I don't actually have many here and this one my dad actually bought and it's for all skin types so we'll see it says uh what does it do it cleanses and gently exfoliates away dead skin cells your skin will be left feeling soft and smooth okay so i'm just got a clip and i'm gonna pin my hair back so i don't get any in there we are i just like rinsed my face with water to get like any of my like stuff off my face because i kept applying moisturizer because my skin is literally so dry let's apply this oh oh it's got little bits in it's avocado <gasps> Oh my god, it smells like avocados. This is nice. Oh yes, this is what I'm here for. My dad picked well. Oh, it sort of like feels like a mousse. I'm going to be tempted to eat it. <laughs> I wonder if it actually says do not eat because I'm one. I'm, I'm, oh yeah, do not con for external, external use only, not for consumption. <laughs> I would never eat it. I've just uh, uploaded my video for tomorrow so that's good because this morning I really wasn't even sure if I was going to film so to have it edited, uploaded, all I've got to do now is edit my thumbnail and upload that I've done all the links to everything so yeah, it's going well I actually quite like it, it's kind of chatty, it's really chilled like all my videos I really am putting this everywhere <laughs> oh my god, it's going very close to my lip and uh which means very close to my mouth which means i'm gonna eat it in a minute i wish i could do it a bit smoother where like you know like oh like a lot of, like just i'm in a film but i guess i don't have a bloody makeup artist it's doing it and it's just me with a finger some people are more bougie and do uh use a makeup brush or like a brush in general i don't know but i don't have one so the finger will do i'm not that bougie i kind of want to just take advantage of these little beads or whatever's in here and uh just circle and motions you know Ooh, that was close to my eye actually i'm just taking advantage of, i'm putting it all on my neck because i mean we've got product and i'm not wasting it i don't think anyone really ever puts a face mask on the neck but hey who said you can't i feel like that's okay yeah there we are. So now I'm gonna relax for 20 minutes and then I'll wash it off. Oh, there's a bit more. Okay. 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 Okay, I'm about to wash it off. Oh my god. This is stuck to my face. What the heck? It's like it's got glue in it. Oh god, it's painful. This part of my head is so painful. Bloody got glue somewhere. So the face mask is off. It was actually really hard to get off. It actually felt like it was like glued to my face. Um, round here is really painful, or it was when I was taking it off. Obviously, it's very red from being sunburnt. I'm now just gonna put a bit of moisturizer on and hydrochloric acid, and I'm literally so close to running out doesn't last long because it says you use it am and am and pm maybe i use too much i don't know but um yeah it's it's almost gone i don't think i'll buy it again either <laughs> but it does feel very nice when your face is sunburned because it's really cool and and then some moisturizer i'm now gonna go downstairs and watch a film with my dad and just chill out i think i might take this out as well this ponytail um and yeah that's it so it's now Tuesday and for some reason I never filmed on Sunday like I literally can't remember what I did so I thought I'd just jump on and end this video. I hope you enjoyed it and uh, please give it a thumbs up if you did. I'm going to include a little clip from yesterday because it was my dog's birthday and it was really cute when he was opening his present so I'm going to include that now. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you very soon. Goodbye.